Hey, welcome to the video. Oh, that okay, awesome intro. Welcome to the video, and inside today's video, I of course have some record news for you. We'll be talking about Creator Gala, we'll also be talking about how you can get customizable dorm rooms now, and of course, stay tuned inside today's video. Of course, though, before we get started, and just like every other video I decide to make, I would greatly appreciate if you guys decided to use my code inside a rec room. To put it very simple, it's like giving me free money that gives you no additional charge at all, and it really just helps support me. Anyways, getting us started, let's talk about this new Creator Gala. Now, if you guys will remember from my last video, where I had talked about previous mentions of how creators were getting emails for Creator's Gala, well, it seems that Rec Room had actually made an official announcement regarding it. Rec Room had said, we're launching a new program called the Creator's Gala. This gala will celebrate the best content of the past year inside of Rec Room, and they have this little link where we can click to learn more. But they do decide to show off this Creator's Gala, you know, type of look. It seems to be the entrance for this actual program. Program. It looks different, but it also looks sort of familiar. I don't know, it, it, some retcon tones ring to me here. But if you guys decide to go inside that link, you guys will read their actual program, and they go on to say this. We're launching a new program called the Creator's Gala today. This gala will celebrate the best content of the past year inside of Rec Room, which are rooms, inventions, art, and avatar items made between July 1st, uh, 2023 and June 30th, 2024, are eligible. We've asked a special group of creators that we're calling the Academy to help us find and highlight content like some other notable rewards run by an Academy. We want these to be decided by people who are active and thriving in our creative community, whether it's success in various contests, creating highly engaging rooms, teaching other Others, the ways of the Maker Pen are helping us on the path to a sustainable, long-term business that we can all benefit from. These creators will be allowed to nominate and vote on content for those awards, and of course, be invited to the party. Now they're giving awards for Best Invention, Best 2D Art, Best Custom UGC Avatar I Rectuber, Slash Rec Talker of the Year, Team in parentheses Creative Club of the Year, Solo Creator of the Year, Emerging Creator of the Year, Best Maker Pen Room, Best Studio Room, Best Rooms 2.0 Room, Best Room Visuals, Best Audio in a Room, Best Innovative Room, best game room, and of course, lastly, best room. Again, this is for content published from July 1st, 2023 to June 30th, 2024, with the exception of best 2D art, which will use creation dates as they may not be in rooms and not published. If you have content that is eligible and you think exemplifies the best effect room, please share it on social media so your networks know that it's eligible. We're encouraging people to use the hashtag Readers Gala to share your creations. Members of the Academy will have received an email with the nomination link. As a reminder, please do not share this link with others as it creates extra work for staff to remove ineligible nominations. And that's all the emails that, you know, creators are talking about and stuff like that. I talked about that in my last video, but pause and read if you guys really want to. The Academy has until 9 a.m. PDT on August 5th, 2024 to submit their nominations and voting will run in mid to late August. We can't wait to see you at the Creators Gala on September 29th, 2024. Then this is their concept art of the actual map inside of Creators Gala and stuff like that, but this is just concept art, it's subject to change. And so yeah, that's pretty much all of Creator Gala. Be sure to let me know your guys' thoughts. Now, sometimes in my videos, I'll ask my viewers about things that I have questions on that I may not know about. Well, I got something special for you guys. This Reckon player was inside their PS5 shop menu with the filter of PSVR 2 games. Inside this, Reckon had showed up. The person that sent me this actual picture had then told me that that they removed it a few minutes ago, so it seems like it might have been like a bug or something, but it's still super strange. To the people that are on PS5 and have PSVR 2, do you notice this as well? Be sure to let me know down in the comments below, I greatly do appreciate it. Now time for everyone's favorite, Murder V3. It has been revealed that people that decide to boost the actual Wired Creations Discord server will get an exclusive kill SFX as well as a skin. SFX will work instantly in a private lobby but may take a few hours before live public lobbies get updated to have it. Which was yesterday, so public lobbies probably have it. They had also released the Murder V3 OST which was Choking Hazard. And only a few days ago, you guys could show off your shine with the diamond skin available now for 4,500 clues, which is an epic skin. Check out Murder V3 and check out these things inside the shop. Ahem! Howdy, partner. Welcome to Sarsaparilla Springs. And it appears that you ain't using my membership. Now, you see, if you want to be in this town, you gotta also be inside the membership as well. Don't worry, I won't blast you just yet. I won't blast you just yet. Let me show you just exactly why you should join the channel membership. Not only do you get access to Sarsaparilla Springs, but you also get shouted out in all my videos. Big shout out to all my pookies and my people that are Sarsaparilla Springs related. 
<laughs> I can't keep doing this bit. Massive shout out to these people. Ultra World 2, Mufi, Abby, Young Creator, Chazzy VR, Jordan the Wolf YT, Dead Channel, PFG on VR, Hack Lassie, Dino Pie, Nat the Pup, S Plus Mania, Carl the Skunk, Hockey Boy, Turkey, Jack Tutorial, Gassy Stuff, Garlic Bread, It's Freddy RR, Dozer Blade Cat, BBB, Burning Owl, Bucket Guy, Yo, Shaky, Raphael, Cloud, Netflix Stein, and of course, Box David. Of course, massive shout out to all these people who decided to join my membership, especially my squidlings. And of course, let's get back to this video. Now, do you want to get custom dorm rooms? Well, it seems like Rick Room actually released a template that allows you to customize an actual dorm room. Now, from what I believe, I'm pretty sure you can actually make this your genuine dorm room, but you can, you know, save it as a clubhouse and be able to spawn there if you really wanted to. Anyways, for the first step that you're going to need to do to be able to do this, you need a maker pen. Once you have your maker pen, go to your palette and spawn in a room door. Once you have your room door, it doesn't matter if it's legacy or the new one, you just spawn it in. Then on your palette, if you guys go to configure and configure this door, you'll want to go to link to room and you want to type this room name in. Then once you do that, you'll get like a little message saying success and then you'll be able to join this. Now when you do join this, you'll be put inside just a regular old dorm room, but it treats it as a public game. So you might join this room with like other people and stuff. What you'll want to do is join this room and then once you're in that room, go to this room and you should see like a little copy button right here. Now, I actually have a copy of the room, so if I go to create and then go to my rooms, I'll eventually see my copy. Here we go, Skulls Custom Dorm Room Template. And then I'll just go to that room. And you'll notice once you join this room and stuff like that, you'll be able to make edits to, you know, stuff that you weren't able to before. As you guys can see, I literally have gotten rid of my mirror and I've gotten rid of my board. I got rid of the board that used to show all the Rick Originals on there too. And yeah, it gets pretty into detail. But I also have a video that I want to show you guys, which will teach you how to remove an actual dorm room wall. Now I'll admit, it would have been more appropriate if I had recorded this inside the Murder V3 map, but I didn't think about it at the time. But I do have a meme of the week. That meme of the week that I had earlier was for last week, but this meme of the week is for this week. So of course, let's get into it. It also is a meme of the week about Murder V3, and <laughs> just watch. Yeah, to sum it up in one word, hackers. Anywho though, that's basically been this entire news video and I really appreciate you guys watching till all the way to this point in the video. It really does mean a lot to me, comment banana if you guys made it this far, and of course, I would greatly appreciate a like and subscription too. If you guys want more Rec Room News content, you guys should be seeing some videos on that side of the screen and stuff like that, and of course, that's all I have for today. Thank you folks, and of course, I'll see you guys inside the next one. Urgh!